Okay. Hello, 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 everybody. And happy Tuesday. Hope you all are enjoying it. Hope you're having a nice week. Nothing too stressful, nothing too boring. Just the sweet spot. And hope you're ready for some more. KCD 1403. All right, so in a second, we'll see where we left last time. We were right in the middle of our investigation. If you guys remember, we found out a couple of streams ago that our enemy has basically an infinite supply of coin because they have a really good... Somehow they found a really... Well, they found a really good way of doing... Of uh, forging uh, Prag Groshen, which is our currency, of course. And they use it to, like, switch around. Basically, they're laundering the money like that. They're just, like, switching it for actual coin. And that way they can, you know, uh, recruit anybody they want, bribe anybody they want, everything like that. So we set off to find out how exactly they're doing it. Uh, we went off to the drop-off spot, way up in the north, next to Ravna, where we met uh, the German knight called Ulrich. I think he's German at least. And after a bit of a struggle and a chase, we beat his ass, and he told us that he's also after the... He's not actually part of the, um, the plot, he's also after those guys, uh, working for a lord that he didn't want to say his name, or who he was. Boy worked with him. We gave. Uh, he had a letter of safe conduct. We gave it to this guy, uh, Tobias Feifar, who we know from Skelets. He's the uh, kind of the master of coin, so obviously he knew a lot about uh, counterfeiting and stuff. And he was very impressed and confirmed that it's very real. And then we went here. We started doing some investigations as to how exactly those guys do it. What are they using? We found out. They need two specific things for forging these coins. One is Quicksilver, which they're apparently getting from the monastery uh, up north here, since they're rebuilding it. Oh, thank you, Frustrated. I do hope I get uh, fucked very soon. Same to you, buddy. And thank you, of course, for the, for the bits very much. Nah, I love you too. It's all good, buddy. How you doing? Uh, come to check out the turf. Oh, I don't know if uh, Ghost told you, but tomorrow we're not going to be doing Mountain Campaign. We're going to be doing, uh, since one of the guys isn't available, so we decided to do like a one-off uh, quick game that's called Everyone is John. And you can Google it up if you want. It looks like a lot of fun. I think we're going to have a lot of fun with it. It's just a one-time thing. Uh, a nice refreshment, I think, after, you know, one from the daily grind of one session a week ago. Uh, so yeah, so they're getting the Quicksilver from the working here. You can see that they're rebuilding the monastery and painting the frescoes. So that's from there. And they're also getting copper from this blacksmith right here named Seth. Uh, basically, they both said that a bunch of scary guys came and threatened them to cooperate or else. And they did. But we found out about it. Uh, we went, we were trying to kind of pinpoint the guy. What was his name again? Let me see. Uh, let's see, making false punch dies for prog Russian requires skilled and experienced hands, and no one has more experience around here than Master Jerome of Silesia. Master Feifar is convinced he can be personally involved, but I ought to leave no stone unturned. So we're gonna, uh, see, it, he doesn't suspect the guy himself, but he thought he, we might as well talk to him. And also there's supposed to be some sort of tree, or some sort of spot a bit up north from the village where they're doing the transactions. So you also wanted us to check that. I think I'm going to do that first. Let me see exactly where did they say. There we go. To Rapoda at a wayside chapel south of the Sassar Woods. Oh, south. I thought the other guy said something else. We all met up with the Wayside Chapel on the hill west of Sasso. So once is west, once is south. I think I'm going to try west a bit first. Uh, what is a chapel exactly? I'm not sure. 
but we might as well just go to the west here, look it up. Oh, actually, this is Sasso, right? Oh, well, it's all Sasso. Mm, yeah, and over here, there's just a river. So I don't know how much further we can go. I think we'll go to the other side of the bridge at the very least. And then start exploring. So south of the Sasso Woods, if I remember right, these are the Sasso Woods. Yeah, we went through here earlier, and there's a lot of place south where we can go. So I don't know, we'll start by going west first, I suppose. Let's go, Mori, how's it going? And hello, Pama. Great to see you, buddy. Did I cross the bridge? I totally forgot. Yes, I did. Okay, so time to go west. Oh, no, that's the... I totally missed the bridge. My bad. Yeah, boy! Yeah. We're going hunting. Hunting for... Forgers. So, yeah. Uh, can you guys tell me exactly what a chapel is? I think it's like some sort of small church or something. Am I right? Any chance this could be it? Right here. No, not for pussy this time. When you first day on your new job. Which which is what? Uh Pama. Yeah, what's your new quote unquote job? What is this place here? Let me see. Just simple folk it seems. Hey, I'm just looking, I'm just looking. Who's there? Okay. Is someone there? Okay, I don't think this is it. There's this foundation of this local corp. Kind of foundation does yeah, exactly, and cultural stuff. Oh, so you work for them? That's kinda nice. What? Is there something written on that? What am I imagining? It's upside down, I think. I guess it's like whatever was inside. I think I've seen similar pots or vessels in the alchemy stations. They hired me to... Who's this guy? Hey, any chance it's the guy we're looking for? No way, right? No, a mercenary. But I might as well ask him. That looks like it might be a small inn or something. I sort of chronicle what they did the last three years since... Oh! Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. And it, yeah, it's totally a job, dude. And it's a pretty cool one at that. So who's this mercenary here? What's the matter? I have a proposal for you. A wager. On this man? A little friendly combat. Just the two of us. Yeah, who are you Who are you, anyway? And what do you do? What do you think? Would you take me for a knight? No, although you are armed like one. True. So a bandit, then? No. Not now, anyway. I'm waiting here Not for now. a merchant who hired me for protection. Would you dare to face me? Not right now, Sorry, but... that's not for me. Fair enough. Unless it, I give up. No, okay. Just want to make sure I got everything ready. That's exactly what I was thinking about. What? How is this doing so badly? God, I need to find a... Maybe I can do something with my kit? I doubt it, though. How is this so badly damaged, though? I thought I uh, fixed everything. Uh, anyway, let me see if I can fix this real quick. Where's my tailor's kit? Oh, there it is. No, ah, oh, goddamn. Well, that's great, but that's not what I. How is that already gone? That kit. That is so weird. Okay, I can't do anything with this. I can fix these. I think there's a glitch surrounding the um, tailor's kit, but whatever. 
Okay, 1v1, we'll do this real defensive. We got them. I think the mace will be a better choice here since he seems to have a fair bit of armor on. So yeah, let's go for this. What the What's the matter? Wouldn't you like to measure your skills? Excellent. Good. They might hire you as official combat, copywriter. Huh? I fear there's nothing else I know, friend. All right. Why not? Here we go. Do you have any coin? Well, surely you didn't imagine we would fight just for the glory of it. Oh, yeah. I have. I got 10k. What's like 50 groschen? Let's go. If he asked nicely enough, I might have even give it to him freely. Quitting. There we go. Yeah, that was a good one. Ah, damn it. Stay away from my horse, dude. Actually, you know what? Let me try. Let's see what are the combos I know with a mace. Oh, none. Okay. Yeah, that simplifies things. Yeah, unfortunately, I didn't have enough time to practice. Damn it! Damn it! Oh, I hate when that happens. That was a good one. Oh, wow, that fucked him up. Is he dead? <gasps> wow. No, I'm not about to kill him. God, the poor guy. Did I just accidentally kill him with one blow to the head? I think he's dead. Oh my god, what did I do? <gasps> Is he... Oh, oh shit. I better get out of here. <gasps> he's... I killed him? I can't believe... Oh, shit. Dude, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't know it was so powerful. Oh, crap. Uh, okay, then. Shit. Okay, feel kind of bad about that, but... If, hey, we bet on some coin, so... You know, I think it's only fair. I mean, you know... I'm honoring his, his agreement. I'm sure that's what he would have wanted. Okay. So can someone please tell me what, what, a, what is a chapel exactly so I know what I'm looking for? Anyway, this doesn't seem to be it. Hmm. Let's go a bit further up north, I think. Maybe we'll... Or maybe straight to the river. If there was something there, I probably would have seen it already. Chap oh, so it is a small church. That's what I thought. Mm, okay, so I need to find one of those. Either to the west of here. Like, around this area. West of the city. I think it, maybe it also said a hill? I'm not sure. Two people and uh, his manservant Rapoda. He was the one who met up at the Wayside Chapel on the hill west of Sasau. I think I'm, if it's like a, a hill, a singular hill west of Sasau that I'm supposed to find out, I think I might have gone a bit too far. Abandoned chapels in the mountains are like very far into them. That's pretty cool, actually. I bet them make like great uh, urban exploration locations. Anyway, yeah, I think I've gone a bit overboard. And maybe it's actually like, I don't know, like this spot right here somewhere? A hill west of Sass? I, I doubt it, but there's also a path over here. 
I don't know, man. Oh, sheep. They're made out of stone and they resist time well. So should be able to spot it. It shouldn't be tiny. But the other guy said that it's like south, right? South of the Sassau Woods. We used to deliver the finished sheets to Rapota at a wayside chapel south of the Sassau Woods. So each of each one of them says it's in a different location, so it might as it could also just be south of the woods as far as I know. Well, I couldn't spot a hill with a chapel on it around here, so let's try and go back. If we see that it's taking too long, I'm just going to skip it. Like, it's not a mandatory uh, quest thing anyway. Oh, hold on. Maybe I can ask... If Ulrich is still here, that is. Yeah, I think I see him. Maybe he knows something about it? I doubt it, but... Wait, am I hungry? Yes, I am. Supposed to pick up a chapel, but being small bins, I'm going to know of any kind of structure. No, yeah, I get that. Just need you guys to keep your eyes peeled, then. Oh, there we go. I might know where the materials from the monastery get passed on to the forges. Where? Up the hill by Sasa Woods. Oh, so it is in Sasa Woods. Shall we go right now? No, I need to find out more. I don't even know if anyone will be there now. But you could keep an eye out there, in case anyone appears, I mean. Agreed. Okay, that's good. Oh, and he's actually going over there. I suppose I could maybe... Wait, where's he going? Is he actually running there? I guess we can just like follow him around. Oh no, he does have a horse. Okay, let's try to follow him then. Just so I know where it is. Ulrich is a jogger? Well, apparently not so much. He loves to run to places. Arenshada. Did you play this game too, Arenshada? Spank them chickens. I can't do it. I can't miss this guy. I gotta know where it is. And apparently it is up here. I thought the Sasa Woods were like the one down here. Maybe it's both. Maybe the... I don't know. Maybe it's like somewhere over here. 87 hours. Damn, nice dude. And you've been to this part? I hope I'm not spoiling anything for you. Oh shit, it's the Riddler! Damn, I like this guy. Uh, I'm gonna have to come back here later. Where am I exactly? Here. Hope you'll still be here. But it's a great game, right, Iron Shada? I, I'm really loving it. Even with the bugs and everything, it's still a really fun game. This one, although I don't recall following him on a horse. Well, I'm not supposed to. It's just I'm more curious to see like where it is and what it looks like. Got through this part without interacting with Ulrich Market. Yeah, I know that this this specific quest, uh, there's a bunch of ways you can do it. You don't have to like even bear Ulrich at all. You can kill him, you can ignore him. There's a bunch of different ways to both to get this quest and to complete it, from what I've read. Yeah, exactly. So yeah, but I'm really liking this. Uh, which was your favorite quest, Arenshada? So far, at least. Actually, I accidentally died at many different points of the quest for me, and I felt so bad I had to keep restarting. Oh, I'm the same thing. I'm the same. Like, if Ulrich... First of... Well, first I hated him. I don't know if you did the chase part, where you chase after him and have to fight him. But I really hated him at first, and then when we got to talking, I started to really like him. 
Well, those are probably the woods they were talking about. I still don't see... Oh, okay. I guess we're going there. I don't see a chapel, though. Teleport poacher quest, and that was interesting. I, do I didn't do that one yet. Would I fuck a horse? Probably not, Mori. Not... At least not of... I don't know. Like, if he wine and dined me, maybe first. If he played his cards right. I might. Uh, but just out of the blue, no. I'm not a... I'm not a horse thought. But yeah, I haven't done any Talonberg quests yet. Uh, I gotta say, the favorite one for me so far has been the... Well, side quest, not main quest, has been the... The witch hunt that you can do in uh, Ushits. Yeah, the other chat I'm being I'm being hosted on another another site. So the other chat is. Oh, look at that! Looks like we found our guys, bandits. Oh, that was... Ow. What? What's going on? What alarm? Oh, nice one, Ulrich. Damn, we're a good team. And I love the fucking crunch with Mace Mercy kills. I just love it so much. Wait, I think actually a sword will work better for this guy. The witch hunt with three men in the woods. Yeah, it was really weird, but that's why I liked it. Uh, so yeah, the other chat, I'm being hosted on a website called savestateheroes.com, so the other uh, chat is there. Come on. And another mercy kill. That was fun. And before, these are like the guys that we had to... Hold on, let me see if there's anything real good I want to grab here before he goes away. Oh, this is good. This is good. This is good. This isn't good. Neither is this. Okay, I think that's it. Oh, wait! What? But there's no chapel here! Well, whatever. It's good enough for Ulrich. Good enough for me. Interesting place. Oh, they got a chest here. Also, good thing Ul Ulrich almost just died for me too, so good thing I did come along with him. I mean, he's really, he's a really good fighter, but I know if he could have taken two of those together. And this is, uh, this is decent. So is this. Let's see, that's it. Anything special I can tell him now? Or Oh, no. Okay, so we got this guy. Where's the other guy? Well, that's no fair, Mori. Starting a poll like that. Uh, what else do we have here? Mm, what do I want to grab? These are decent. This is good. This is really good. <clears throat> this is shitty. This is decent. This isn't. This isn't. This isn't, and this is. Okay, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, those are hairy legs. Holy shit. Those are ugly ass feet. Oh god. Well, I think we did him a service in the end. Oh, would you look at that? Turns out Twitch is cooler. Everybody go to Twitch now. Okay, so yeah, now we can actually do the quest. Oh, I wanted to go to the... If the Riddler is still there. Really want to get another shot. And... Endorsement. We're gonna spank some chickens. Next chicken I see, I'm gonna spank. Ah, damn it, he's gone. It was right here. 
Oh well. Fingers crossed. He'll pop up again soon. Alright, so for now... Let's go and talk to that... Whatever he was. And see what he knows about this illegal operation. Doing. Oh, that's yeah. They got two millers here. Henry. Oh, it's a baker. Damn. Oh, maybe I can sell him some of this. No, I can't. So I could sell some of the stuff I got. Maybe the miller. Is he also a fence or? My respects to you. Is he a decent miller? Like God fearing. Oh well, I might as well ask. Is there any work my friends? For carpenters. Carpenters. I'm not looking for anyone at the moment. Hey, Henry's come to see you. Oh well, I tried. All right now. Assuming he's in here. Hmm? Oh, I can hear something. I guess he's upstairs then. What is this place? Oh. Well, if no one's gonna see me, I might as well just do like real quick practice here. Yeah, not even interested in stealing. Just want to get better at that. Oh, what? He's like... Like on the other side. Maybe I can just parkour my way? Oh, yeah. Hardcore parkour. Welcome, Henry. Oh, thanks, dude. We haven't met yet, but I see my reputation precedes me. Anything of interest? I don't think so. Okay, let me remove my unappealing pieces of clothing. I think the hauberk, yeah, that helped. I think the rest is actually beneficial, so I'm not gonna... Oh, maybe the Bianca's ring, maybe? No, doesn't matter. This? Neither. Uh, okay then. Let's give it a try. Master Jero! God save you, Henry! God be with you. How goes the work, Master? Getting there, getting there. You need something, my boy? What are you doing here, anyway? You're in an engraver's shop, my boy. We're engraving. Oh, right, right, right. He was yeah, talking about how the engraving on the coins was oh, really top-notch. wood and stone as well as metal. Here in the monastery, it's mostly about decoration. Well, you've got quite a large workshop, Master. You don't do all the work alone, surely. I'm usually here with my apprentice Florian. Florian. Of course, he might be the guy. Observation, you'll note that this is not currently the case, and I'm here alone. Which means that either I'm a liar or something out of the ordinary has occurred. Um why do you lie to me? I think. So what's happened to Florian? He shares the fate of the pharaohs, but today the fifth scourge of Egypt did smite him. The plague. Or so his message advised me. Jesus Christ, the plague? Really? Do remain calm. I'm quite certain the plague from which Florian is suffering wasn't a judgment from on high. Or if it was, it was a judgment on excessive drinking. I'm told such an ailment can be of truly biblical proportion. I see. What's he like, your apprentice, Florian? I'm afraid that his exuberant youth has taken its toll. He's been acting strangely of late. I fear he has delusions of persecution. Okay. I don't really know what you mean. It's definitely him, no doubt. Recently, for example, he told me that someone was following him. And the very next day, he bought a padlock from the blacksmith and locked up his chest. As though I would ever sneak into it. In any case, why the... Oh, that was probably the one chest that Something was like that. very hard to unlock. May I ask why? Why? 
I'll have a message for him. A message? Who would be interested in that wastrel? Other than his furious and deeply disappointed master, of course. About your question, you'll find him at home. No doubt feverishly dying. Nice. He sleeps in the baker's cellar. Oh, so ah. right next door. Thank you. Does Florian have any enemies? A man such as he certainly owes money at every turn, and the parents of local girls are undoubtedly displeased with his attempts to propagate. However, most recently it was that fury from the baths who accosted him in quite a spectacular fury? rage. Huh. A woman from the baths? What did she do? I think we should talk well, to her Harvey first. Nearly tore all Florian's hair out. I don't frequently feel sorry for my near do well apprentice, but on that occasion I made an exception. Do you have any idea why she did it? It she really is bad. About some girl. I agree with you 100%. I really Barbara like him. Esther. I would say that Florian had felt the joys of spring and acted accordingly. Although one would have thought they'd be used to that sort of thing at the bathhouse. Thank you. I'll leave you to your work. All right. Let's go check that out then. Oh no, that was the very hard one. Well, it still could be the apprentices, I suppose. Is this just another exit? Yep. All right, so we got two objectives, right? The Lady of the Baths. Oh, the baker lives over there. Oh, over here. I thought this was the baker's. Maybe not. Anywho. Yeah, he's in, he was in the IT crowd, Palma, but he's also, well, he's also a director. He directed a movie that I heard was, like, it was nice. Nothing amazing, but pretty decent. And I also heard that, well, I haven't heard. I know that he was also sometime a member on the Big Fat Quiz of the year, or, you know, all of its other editions. Where am I going again? Where's the bridge? I think it's over there. Yep. Baths are right here, right? Yeah, the white tents. Oh, missed the exit, the entrance. Yes, Palma. Oscars, onions now. Ah, I watched it. The only interesting. Gary Oldman deserved that Oscar, but not for that role. Um, it was just like a same like DiCaprio, you know. I don't usually watch the Oscars, but a friend of mine decided to do like an Oscar party, so I said, "What the hell?" Uh, it was a really, really boring ceremony. None of the jokes landed well. Uh, the only fun or cool part was when they went to the theater across the the street, and oh, that adorable Mark Hamill! You could just see him like, "Oh, me, I want to go," and that was great. I always love him. Uh, other than that, it was a real cringe show to watch him try and uh, make those lame jokes they gave him work with the other cast members. Uh, other than that, I don't know. It was like a really political, really boring one. And it's all bullshit. Like, I, I don't get excited about these things because it's all just like, you know, rich people masturbating for a couple of hours. Really boring. So, I don't know. Nothing really amazing for me. Mark Hamill is amazing, very charismatic. He seems like a genuinely nice guy. I don't think I've ever heard a bad, like a, sh a shitty story about him. And I love his reactions to like the Last Jedi, trying to warn everybody, and then uh, unfortunately falling in line once Disney got mad. And that's it. Those are basically my onions on the Oscars. It's a really unimportant ceremony and award. Uh, like, I don't know. It's glamorous, that's it. But it has absolutely zero importance. Rich people masturbating. Did very well in video games? I don't know how many, uh, roles he had in video games. I know that obviously he's a legendary... He's a legendary, uh, voice actor. 
even beyond the Joker, he did some really, really great stuff. And I don't know, he's just like an all-around great, and he's fucking Luke Skywalker. I mean, it doesn't even matter that he's if how good an actor he is. He's fucking Luke Skywalker. I grew up on that guy. He's the main com character in the Wing Commander. Really? I know that he did like I know that he did the Joker in some video games. I don't know how many times he did Luke. I think that like in Jedi Knight and stuff, he wasn't Luke. Uh, I don't know though, and different titles as well. I'm not sure, but I know that he's a great guy. I hear you're at odds with Apprentice Florian. At odds? I'll give you at odds. It's that sod's fault they took my Esther. They? Poor girl. I shudder to think what's become of her. Hmm. Wait, what's my next objective? None. What exactly happened? This man came in wanting a bath, and Esther with it. She doesn't normally offer that kind of service, but I didn't see the harm, so I sent her in to him. And suddenly I hear screams. So I run out, and I see the bastard pulling her out of the tent and shoving her into a boat. Oh, he can... Oh. Okay, I think I get it. So they're like together or something, or they, they have something between them, Florian and Esther. And in order to make him engrave the coins, they kidnapped his his girl or something. I'm sorry they took her, but what exactly has it got to do with Florian? They shouted at me to tell Florian that when he rises up, he'll get the girl back. Yeah, okay. Or he stopped working with them, and that's why they kidnapped her. I assume that Florian knows this, Esther. You know, village girls. They don't get much of a choice. Every other knave has a turnip for a brain. And if they don't, Good they're relatives. And then some young dandy turns up who writes her little poems. What's the poor girl to do? And this is how it ends. She should have stuck with the turnip heads. Hmm. Uh, I'll try to check it out, Palma. I'm not sure if I'll find the time, unfortunately. Having a busy couple of weeks. But yeah, sounds cool. Any chance to see Mark Hamill is, uh, is one that I'll take. Also, Mark does really great cameos. Like, he was even on The Flash, and I really enjoyed him there. You can tell that he's having, like, a lot of fun, and he likes being goofy and shit. Where can I find this Florian? I'd like to ask him a few questions. He works in the engraver's workshop at the Monastery Craftsman's Yard. And if he's not there, he'll be holed up like the rat he is in the cellar he rents from the baker. He's afraid of me, for sure. Of course they do, Maury. I'm surprised you don't know about it. You'd be the one I'd imagine who would. Uh, I think it's called the PMVs or something. AMA, I don't know. Adult, I don't, I don't remember. But yeah, it's definitely a thing. And they have the most hilarious fucking category names too. What did the bailiff make of it? Don't even get me started on that. He's another fine youth. I won't say what. I told him everything, but he says he won't do nothing about it. What an asshole. Good thing I'm here. He wouldn't tell me to my face, of course. But people here don't think much of us. There's some as reckon my Esther deserves what she got. Poor girl. Also, more, I even know that um, there's even gay porn award ceremonies, or at least one. I know because I read about uh, Billy Harrington after he died, and apparently he won a bunch of... Uh, those kind of awards. It sounds like you were close to Esther. I loved her like my very own. She came to me as an orphan, like a wolf child she was. I raised her and taught her and gave her a job, and now she's gone. Who knows if she's even alive? Okay, I think I got it. Um, okay, so I know about that. I can help him out. He'll probably... Do I have some time for what time is it? Oh, it's actually afternoon, so no. If it was morning, I would go for it. Nobody really watches it. Well, there are like you know porn, like die-hard porn fans who go to the porn conventions and all of that. So they definitely watch that. Or you know people who are like obsessed with porn stars and such. I just told you why I know about gay movie, the gay porn movie awards. I knew you'd, you'd pull something like that. 
Okay, so wait, where exactly is the baker then? Oh, it's the other, it's that house. Could you name any porn filmmaker, for example? Uh, I don't know. I know that some stars also like direct and produce their own films. Mostly, like you know, the stars that make it big usually stop working for other firms and start doing their own. I know that much. Like they just open up their own production company and do things their own way because that's how they like it. So, a bu like some of the bigger stars probably also have. Oh, wow, this is where he lives. This really is a shithole. He doesn't even have a window. God. Old bastard. Welcome, Henry. Could I without searching? I think um, Sasha Gray. No, not Sasha Gray. What's the other one that looks like her? Uh, Stoya. Stoya, I'm pretty sure has a production com company. Probably also like a lot of women, like Jenna Jameson, if she's even still active, probably has one. Like, there's a bunch. A lot of actresses produce their own films. Not all of them, Maury. There's actually a bunch of like really fun, funny uh, porn movies, usually parodies. I remember I thought it, I think I even saw once, um, or I saw that there exists a movie, a documentary about like the relationship between porn and humor, and like the jokes that they like to put in there. Even like from the 70s, they, I, I remember seeing clips of like jokes in porn from the 70s of like a guy eating a woman out and she's lighting up a cigarette and she's like, oh, you don't mind if I smoke while you eat, do you? That kind of dumb stuff. Which is, you know, why would they even put it there? Well, because sex is fucking funny, that's why. Uh, so same thing. And I remember, and there have been like porn movies that I watched, and I was actually like just laughing because they were just so goofy and just having fun between the sex scenes. It's really dumb, it's really retarded, but it's 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 silly and funny. What can I say? Standard porn art. Oh, I don't know that much about porn movies to tell if there's like a legitimate arc. I wonder if they follow the what's it called? I think it was Socrates. Socrates. So Socrates is the way you pronounce it. Uh, I think Socrates was the one who like invented the the original plot or the original structure for uh, generic movies. So I wonder if they use that too, or if there was another philosopher who thought of one for porn movies. You look quite sprightly for an invalid. What? Who the hell are you? My name's Henry, and I'm making inquiries for Sir Radzig Kobola. And what do you want from me? Straight to the point then. All right. I've been investigating counterfeit money, and the trail led me straight to you. Does the name Rapporteur mean anything to you? Um, I, I don't know. Uh, maybe? Don't bother. I know you know him. You make the punch dies for the counterfeiters. How do you hand them over? Do you know where their workshop is? I can't say anything. I'll deny everything, and you've got nothing on me. No evidence, just accusations. Yeah, but you confess. <laughs> oh, yeah, let's... Let's go straight to the point. It's I know what it's about. That girl, hasn't it? How do you know? I know everything. That doesn't matter. No, I, I suppose not. I didn't want to get involved, I swear. Those bastards kidnapped Esther. If I don't cooperate, they'll kill her. Who is Esther? My girl, of course. That scum took her right out of the bathhouse. He doesn't mind his girl being, like, a whore. Sorry about that. Me too. Listen, I'll tell you everything. I promise. But yeah, yeah. Let me go Esther's save her. Safe. What, so I'm to go searching for her in the woods. I know where they're keeping her, but nobody will help me. And what can puny little me do faced with those strapping great villains? I wasn't really listening. What did he say? I know where they're keeping her, but no. Oh, there we go. That's easy. Um, yeah, I want to go save Esther. Poor girl. She deserves better. Let's just go save her. Very well. I'll bring back your Esther. Really? Yes, but then you have to tell me everything. 
I will. I swear to God Almighty. Please, just bring her back to me. Nothing else matters. Where are they keeping her? I mean, I can't really sit idly by while, you know, hills. the poor girl is being kidnapped, probably killed while once we'll bust them. That's where I saw her last. They took me there when I All said the way to her. All right. I'll go there and try and think of something. You're my savior. Yes, I, I know. Get your hopes up. Anything can happen. She doesn't die. Game is saved. Anything else I can talk to him about? Look here, Florian. Bring Esther. I'll bring you Esther, but there's no time to waste. I need you to tell me right now. I thought we had an agreement. Fine, fine. We'll leave it be for now. Okay. Honestly, if it was pretty much anything else, I just talk my way out of it. But the poor girl. All right, so we're going to the place where Esther is being held. What I really need to do first, though, is... Well, I hope they have a tailor here. Let's see. It's a big city. They should have one. I don't see why not. If they have a scribe, I mean. If not, I honestly don't think there's another city around here that... Oh, and I think... Yep. Just in luck. I think I'm going to buy like a couple of those kits this time. Because they ran out so quickly. God be with you, Henry. God be with you. Uh, I don't have time to actually browse everything, but... Uh, yeah, let's buy both of those. And later we'll see about <coughs> fixes, if there's anything that I can't do. Let's talk about the... Well... Since it's you... You're a right pinch purse. Good health to you, Henry. Oh, damn. Finally, a reasonable sum. Okay, let's see if we can do anything with that. Yep. Oh, I can sell a bunch of these things too. I haven't even thought of that. Yeah, let's do that. Let's see what we got here. Can sell this, can sell this, not this. Um, oh, should I sell the, the wrong one? Uh, this one, this, this and this. Both of these. These, these, and these. Well, that, I should have said. Um, yeah, okay, cool. That thing is so rich. Let's talk about the price. Well, we can try it. Since it's you, that's still too much. Don't shave, Henry. Man, everybody adores me. All right, so nice. Uh, depends. Some of them I really enjoy, but not like a select few. If they're really good or really wacky and zany, then I, I enjoy them. But I don't actively go searching for uh, for Let's new mashups. Hmm. All right. So, are we agreed? You're a right pinch purse. See now, I knew. Excellent. Okay, so I'm all good. Uh, oh, I don't need the spade here either. How come? Hold on. So the other one didn't didn't disappear? I'm so confused about these. Anyway. No, because I have two, so I don't know why it's like that, but sure. So these two, and let me just check regarding the blacksmith kit. Okay, 
anything else I might need to fix? Oh yeah, these two. Kind of sucks that I can't really fix... I might as well stop through the, the armor, the master armor they have here. Yeah, I'm about the same as Palma, I'd say. So they got like a master armor here, right? Somewhere around here. Yeah, there. Hey, Henry's come to see us. Everyone in this town is a Good fucking master. What do you need? What? Oh, he can't fix. What about the artisan? My respect to you. Yeah, that's not the master, but what? Why can't I? That's so weird. Okay, good thing there's like a gazette. No, no, no. Ah, whatever. Forgot I wanted to stay outside. Okay, so yeah, good thing there's like a million other blacksmiths in this town. Mm, this isn't it though. Next one. Whoops. Now! So watch where you're going, you louse! Yeah, you sorry, man. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my bad. So, Mikesh. I'll be with you. Finally. Uh, yeah, these two. Let's have a word about the price. Hmm, alright, so. Is this enough? No. And how mad is he? Ah, yeah. oh, that would do it. Excellent. Let me see if there's anything extra I can sell him too, maybe. Oh wait, does he have anything? What's like his most powerful? Really shitty stuff. Nothing good. Okay, that's good to know. I can sell this. I can sell... I guess that's it. Oh, all this metal. Definitely. And... Yeah. I think that's it. All right, excellent. Let's have a word about the. Well, I wish they they should have done the interface this, that you can ask for repairs and what do you say to this? Haggle for selling and buying you stuff. Convince me with that. At the same time, or like at the same screen at least. Finally. A reasonable sum. Alright. We're all ready. Let's go save the girl. Turns out we are hunting for Pussy Mori. Who knew? I suppose if you wish hard enough for something. Wait, which... How exactly do I get there? That's a good fucking question, actually. Um... I want to get to Ravna. Okay, looks like there is a bridge somewhere around here. So this is where I want to get to. I think. Basically, to... Samopesh. Like to Samopesh, I just need to go... Oh, yeah, just straight... Oh, yeah, actually, I, I went this path a couple of times. I remember it. Save the girl fucker first. I girl... Want some saving? I. Yeah, I think I think that's the that's the way you should say it. I 
I actually really want to do the quests in the monastery. I really like the whole uh, construction set they have there. Hello, chairs. Great to see you, dude. Wait, who's that? Oh, just a wayfarer, I suppose. I thought he had a sword, but no. So how you doing, man? Oh, shit, what's... Oh, fuck, it's cumins and badnets again. No, I'm gonna... I'm gonna have another fight on my head. I don't have time for this. It's cumins and badnets anyway. I'm gonna have to kill all of them. I don't feel like it. Don't want to ruin, like, the condition of my weapons and armor and all that. Okay, I think this is already Samopesh. So what I want to do is actually... I want to cut through the force there. And those are... Oh dear! Nice. I think this is the clearing, and... Wait, this can't be the river, can it? No, oh, I kind of missed it. But no, it seems like there is some sort of weird path. Kind of like a half path, if you know what I mean. A bit more. There we go. Yeah, dirt road, I guess, is... Uh... Oh, and I found the conciliation cross. Cool. Okay, so from here... Hmm. How's this? Oh, it's just a fishing spot. Hmm. Doesn't really seem like there's a path through here, honestly. So, oh, maybe something... Hold on. Aw, oh, come on! Well, I might as well just go... If I'm already here, I might as well just go along the river. Maybe I'll get lucky. I was... Oh! Yeah, there we go. I was positive they showed me another... route. Or is that... No, that might not cut it. Let's see after we cross. Figure out what's this place. Hmm. Interesting side, eh? What's so interesting about it? No one here. Hmm. Well, it ain't that interesting. Oh, there we go, yeah. Thought there might be a grave here. Uh, where exactly is it? That spot? This? Yep, okay, cool. Uh, let's go grave robbing. Favorite activity. I think it was even in, uh, Super Flying Ducks stream of Darkest Dun Duckest Duck Gen. They chose to be a grave robber or something. Nice, this is good. This is really good. This is really, really good. This is amazingly fucking good. Magdeburg, wow, holy. Plate armor, yeah, too bad it's plate. But it's gonna give me a lot of money. Necklace, that's cute. Odd die. Playing die loaded in favor of odd numbers, huh. That'd be good for that game, if I can use it. And a nice book, wow, this was a great fucking find. Gotta say. About this armor, though. Like, I can't, obviously, I can't put it on. Yeah, and I'm losing the, the buff. Too bad. I might just save this, though. A lance rest. This is really nice. I wonder if it's... I might save this one, we'll see. Because I know that there is one set that you can find pieces of scattered all around. It's supposed to be on the treasure maps, but 
who knows, maybe one of them leads here. I can also probably send back the spade. Oops. Okay. And our travel continues. So where am I right now? Okay, yeah, so I did I did make the cross. What what's going on here? Where is everybody? Oh come on! Wait, are these guys bandits or no traitor? God in heaven. Oh, fuck it, I'm using my I don't have time for this. I have to use this, they're wearing like all kinds of armor. Okay, he's down. That's one down. Oh! Did someone- <gasps> Did you shot my horse?! Little shit! Okay, he's gone too. There we go. Let me hear the crunch I like. Mmm! Oh, and there's the last guy. I think he killed the, the traitor. Come on. I think you're hot stuff with your fucking spear, huh? Piece of fucking wood. Ah, so close. But I heard someone saying something. I think everyone died except the one guy who cowered and asked everyone else to save him. Oh, asshole! That was a good hit. God damn it, he's annoying. Maybe I should get my sword out. Fuck! God damn it, I'm gonna have to rest now because of this asshole. Okay, screw this. I'm switching to a sword. That might work a bit better. Is he speaking Polish? No, I think it's Hungarian or something. They're Cumans. And yeah, it's because of the metal armor. They told me that like if the enemy is wearing no armor, then it's better to use a sword. If he's wearing plate armor, it's better to use like sword does barely anything. It's better to use a mace, because plate armor usually doesn't have a lot of uh, defense against blunt damage. Now, Carton. Oh. Shit. <laughs> Yes! Okay, he's hurting. Yes! If you could just hit him once in the head, it's a fucking goner. Also, he seems to be defending badly against stabbing attacks. Oh, yeah! That's how we do shit! Nice. You're welcome, kind sir. Oh, he's not even... Fuck off. So everybody's dead now. And I'm badly damaged. Probably my uh, gear as well. At least partly, yeah. Okay, let's see what we can fix. And what we gotta deal with. That battle was a lot of fun. It was way better than usual. Especially against a number of enemies. But it's because I started using the mace more, I think. How's it looking now? 
I don't know why I can't fix... Maybe it's because I'm wearing this on top of it? I don't know why I just can't fix the, the Hawbrick or the Bigandine. I find it really, really odd, but whatever. Okay, it's so doing fairly well. And Okay, so equipment isn't too badly damaged. It's definitely good enough, but I'm going to have to... He actually killed that other guy that was helping me out. Kind of saved, kind of saved my ass a couple of times. Uh, maybe, or maybe the other guy just ran away. I'm not sure. Can't find his body either way. I know that some people ask from the devs for an option to like bury bodies out in the middle of nowhere, just because it's like the Christian thing to do, or if I don't know, there's someone that you like. Anyway, let's see. What's worth it? This is worth it. Oh, dried meat is always nice. Glossian. Definitely this. This. Not this. Not this. And not this. He's just lost now. He doesn't know what to do. There's the second guy. Well, I have a bed here. I might just... I think I'll read a bit and go to sleep here, and I'll feel much better in the morning, I bet. Then we can start fresh and go hunt. Any other humans around here? Already looted that guy. There were two people here who weren't humans, two other traders, and now they're just fucking gone. Oh, there's the archer who shot my horse. He definitely deserved that shit. Uh, let's see. Human harness, it looks kind of kinky. This is decent. This is decent. This. Nice. Uh, I think that's it. Laszlo? Why Laszlo? Is that a very common human name or something? Let's see. Oh, this is nice to have. We're going to have a shit ton of them. Uh, no, yes, no, 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 yes. Mm, yes, yes, and that's it. I'm really hungry enough to heal myself too. And I can see the start the sun starting to go down in the west, so. So yeah, let's just go to sleep in that haunted house we found. Or not haunted, but like the house with the grave behind it. It's a good opportunity, and I might as well use it. Oh really? The John of Hungary you feel I didn't know that. Oh my poor horse ran away to the river where he feels safe. So adorable. English version is Leslie. Huh. Didn't know that, Palma. Thanks, dude. Okay, so hopefully no one is gonna come and bother me here, but this is a decent bed, I think. Might even oh I can only sleep here though. I guess I won't read. Let's see how much I can sleep and then we'll see what I'll do. If I can wake up at six. Uh I can wait for two hours, it's not so bad. So this should heal me right up. Maybe, well, we'll see how sunny it is. Because the sun is probably going to be pretty... I think it's probably going to be pretty illuminated by the time we reach the, the mines. Oh, the game even saved. Oh shit, where am I? Okay, yeah, it's not really daytime yet, is it? Uh, I'm not that hungry. I want to check for a second. I started thinking, do I have anything in maintenance I can use right now? Oh, I've I've opened these up. I guess I missed it. 
Okay, then yeah, definitely this. Both of these, definitely. Uh, actually, all of these are really good. I think I'll go from like the, the highest level to the lowest. Okay, let's start with this. Then we'll go to Blacksmith Sun too. And the rest we'll get as we go along. Good, These this will help me a lot, I think. Okay, other than that, let's wait for like, I think an hour is going to be enough. Come on, Pebbles. Hope you enjoyed your bath. Okay. So the mines are somewhere in that mountain, I imagine. Wait, does this also have anything to do with that other quest I had? Yeah, these. Are these like in the same area? Nope, not at all. Okay, so I guess I'll drop this for now too. Alright, let's head out. Oh, that guy is still just wandering around here. Clueless from having survived. Having no idea how to repay me or how to use his, uh, his life. His newly acquired lease on life. So, okay, we got a path over there. Let's keep going a bit more. Oh, damn. Did I go off road? It's starting to get like really rocky here. already a mine. Huh. But yeah, it's too far away. It can't be the right one. I don't know. Should I go exploring? I think not right now. Might get lost and that definitely won't help the poor girl. So I just keep trying to make my way up there, I suppose. What is that? Again, can't tell if this is a really weird glitch or part of something? I don't know. Interesting side, huh? Can I turn this switch? No. Can't do anything. Okay, yeah, looks like part of the mining operation. Maybe this is where they like, I don't know, bring up the, what they mine or something? If it's too long of a haul to, you know, bring it to the front door, they might use these. What? There's a camp there. see first how much of this marigold I can take and then let's see if they're friendly or not or even if it's occupied which it doesn't seem to be Yeah, it looks like it's good. Oh, Eyebright! It's pretty valuable. Okay. 
looks pretty safe. Okay, yeah. Whoever they are, they're not here right now. Hmm. Fire's dead too. Doesn't that look almost like a medieval crack pipe? This, uh, I forgot what it's called. Distiller, I think. Where are you? Oh, there's a house over there. Okay, so they can be anywhere around here. What are my clues exactly? Somewhere in Scaled Hills? Oh. Oh, so it's just somewhere around here. It's not necessarily inside the, the mines. Okay. I think these houses are, are like out of the, the area where I can search, but uh, looks abandoned too. I guess maybe these were just camps that the Scalitz miners used? I don't know if this is considered part of the Scalitz mines since it's kind of far away. But the mines were like these ones. But I don't know, maybe that's why they have a camp though. That would make sense. What camp? That one? I just passed or am I entering another one right now? No, it's over there. I think I should probably go on foot from here. Okay, yeah, that definitely looks like a good spot to keep someone. Yeah, I got a pretty good solid feeling about this one, even though it's uh, still a big area, but... Not seeing anyone yet. Oh, there we go. Oh, and I found it. Yep, confirmed. So do I need to kill them all, or is there a chance I can talk to them? Save Esther. I can see one guy over there in the distance. Is there another one standing over there? Uh, no, I guess not. So she's definitely here. It can't be just one guy guarding her. Try to circle the perimeter. Also making a lot of noise, I know that, but yeah, like I'm not being sneaky at all. Unless I get the, I don't think I do though, have the, no, this isn't considered a forest, unfortunately. Could be that there's just like one guy outside, oh yeah, there he is. Seems to have a helmet too, so I think arrows won't be very useful here. Oh, there's another guy. Yeah, it looks like they're gonna come to me. Should probably switch arrows. I might still get a one good shot, maybe two. If I get enough distance. So I see two. The problem is that guy seems to be wearing plate. I don't think I can do anything about him. Not with a bow and arrow, at least. Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, goddammit! Come on. Oh! Asshole, you shot me! Shit, I missed. Okay, hold on, hold on. For this guy, I think I need my mace. 
Just a quick change here. Whoa. Asshole. God damn it. You're dead. Shit, they're good fighters too. Don't want to get flanked. Got weak at the knees, have you? Fuck. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna deal with the archer first, real quick, or at least try to. I'm gonna go from easiest to hardest. Okay, perfect. That's one down. Now the guy without the shield. Damn it. Is that all you've got? There we go. Ah, oh, shit. Wasn't ready. Okay, looks like nobody else is coming, so that's actually pretty good. Fuck, he's a good fighter, though. Oh, dear. That hurt. There we go. Yes! Asshole. Oh, that was a good one. And a dodge. Oh, fuck. How do you do that? I'll get you, you swine. Damn it. Yes! Oh, that was a good one. Give me that crunchy. Mmm. Love that shit. God, I'm enjoying fighting more and more. Since I've gotten good at it. Okay, let's see how bad is the damage. Uh, let's get our kits in here. That's good. That's good. Sorry. And... Nice. Okay. Looking good. Double stab? At what point? I'm sorry, I wasn't paying that much attention. Because I'm kind of dirty. I should probably take a bath when I get back. Um... What did... Oh, yeah. I wanted to check. Same sound. Oh, I wasn't... Wait, what? Why wasn't... Oh, I'm an idiot. I wasn't wearing it, but oh well. Okay, but yeah, the rest seems pretty decent. The harbor could use some fixing. Other than that, though, I, though, I think I'm fine. Okay. Oh, key to shed. Might as well have that, even though I'm going to try to break it open anyway. Uh, this, this, not this, not this, this. Mm, this. Uh, this, and not this, and not this, and this. And somewhere I'm supposed to be over encumbered, but I'm not. Very interesting. I'm liking this. Another key to the shed, nice. Uh... That's good, that's not, that's okay, that's good, that's not, that's okay, this is great, no, yes, okay, and no. Okay, I think there was like one more guy. Man, I should have used the mace much more. And the chest, oh, it might, I think it was, um, it might have been, a, what's my call it? Uh, Ripost. Sometimes when when you time it just right, then he does like a little extra move. So that might have been it. So I totally earned that. Hmm. Eh, kettle hat. Nah. Yeah, that's nice. Master Huntsman sword. That's not worth it. This is. This isn't. This isn't. And this isn't. 
I think that was it, right? Or is there... Are there, are there gonna be more surprises soon when I come close? Oh, I'm trespassing. Oh no. On banded territory? Why are these considered stealing? I got a, I got him fair and square off of a dead person. Whatever. Uh, what did I want to do? Oh yeah, turns over some of these things to my horse. Like this, and this, and these. Good enough. Hmm, what do we have here? Nice place to sleep. I love that they say I'm trespassing when it's fucking bandit ground. Wait, were those guys actually... They were bandits or cumans? I didn't even pay attention. I think they were talking Polish or Czech. Oh, and one of them Vitality. What were these guys exactly? Oh yeah, bandits. That's what I thought. And, come on. Anything good here? Not really. Any other chests? Any good loot? Any... I'm not hungry. Huh. So it goes straight up from there. There's a conciliation cross there. I want to check it out. Make sure that those kegs aren't lootable. What? I already found this. When? Okay. I wonder if these conciliation crosses were actually a thing. Or is it just something that they did for their Kickstarter supporters? Which is cool. It's just kind of wondering. Alright, so yeah, it looks like that was all of them. Unless there was one guy inside who already killed her or something. Very easy. If they want if they give me a key for that, come on. Give me some credit. Hello, it is I, your savior. I owe you anything? Just please take me away from here. Anything you say, huh? Very interesting. Uh, yeah, they only got they only gave her some wine and shit apparently. Do I agree with that? Bitches ain't shit, but hoes and tricks. I'd say um, mo bitches are mostly. Hoes and tricks, but not not just hoes and tricks. They Generally, uh, though, I'd say yes, Whoever with some exceptions. Me? Florian told me where they took you. I'm a fool. Well, it'd be funny to just like come across these guys, I suppose. Why? And it turns out he's a villain in league with thieves and a coward too. This whole time, he knew where I was. I would have. <laughs> What a fucking virtue signaling. Um, it's fine, yeah. It's not Florian's fault. He was terrified they'd do something to I'll him. I'll help the guy. I had him over a barrel. You're right. Poor Florian must have been more scared than me. I'd say so. We should probably set off. I'll go, I'll with, go you. with you. I'd hate to lose you on the way. Is this like an actual escort mission, or...? Was it that I just trigger a uh, shortcut? Oh, nice. Fast traveling. Okay, I can deal with that. Oh, and time isn't even passing. That's even better. Excellent. So definitely a nice shortcut. Probably won't, gum, won't run into any trouble as well. Found an accident along the way, apparently. And here she is. Has something happened? Oh no, that's not her. 
Oh, it's the baker. It's where he lives or something, right? Where's that kid? Yeah, I'll talk to him. Then I'll go to the bath house. I need a bath. Badly. My God, what happened to you? You look like you've been assaulted. Yes, it's because I saved your fucking girlfriend, asshole. That's why I look like I've been assaulted. I found that Esther of yours. I know. Back already. How can I ever thank you? By telling me all about the goings-on with Rapunzel. They found me in the tavern one evening. Caught me when I went to the ship pile. They started to badger me about working for them. They? Yes, Rapata. On a night they called Sir Yezek. And then Yezek. They explained what they wanted from me and I told them to sod off. I'm guessing that didn't go down too well. It wasn't all that bad. They just threw me on the dung heap and left. I thought it was just a drunkard's joke. But then they took Esther. That's a good question, actually. Why didn't you tell anyone? At first, I took it for a bad joke. And then, when they snatched Esther... Well, actually, if the bailiff didn't do anything, then he really was. Like, he probably doesn't have enough money to hire a mercenary or something. So I imagine... Yeah, he could only turn to the bailiff, and we know that he didn't do anything about it. Where will I find Rapata? He's usually wherever I am. What does that mean? Nice. So you got yourself a bait. He watches me everywhere I go. And when I'm at home, he sits on the bench in the square, watching my house. So he's there now? Hard to say. That's convenient. Sometimes I see him in the tavern on the green, buying supplies. All right. At least I know where to start. And you go to work tomorrow, you hear? Why? Because I said so. Because we have to lure him out. And besides, your master will surely be glad to see you. I have my doubts. I suppose I'd better go. I'd hate the bastard to get away. Good luck, and thanks for the help. Yeah, yeah. Keep it more careful. Bitch. So what do you say something about a square? Watching him? Oh, yeah. There's a tavern here. Tavern on the green. Yep. Henry, I'm glad you so he's either one of them. Nope. But the innkeeper will probably uh, give me a good head start. Oh, maybe he meant like this place inside? or What does my quest tell me? Let's see. Find Rapata. Yeah, but there's no specific map location, right? Right. Sits at the market square and watches Florian's house. Okay, so before that, like I said, I need a good bath. Also heal me up a bit. And next time I get the chance, I should probably fix some of my stuff as well. Maybe I'll even see Esther. Give her a second chance to thank me. God be with you. Or not. I don't know. Is that a black girl? No, it's not. Show yourself. Be a bit more careful. I'd like to know more about the kidnapping. I just brought her back. Idiot. I'd like to make use of the bathhouse's services. Uh-huh. And what do you want? Um, yeah, let's go for everything. Hello. Uh, I'm glad you well, I certainly need a physician to treat my wounds. Then a hot bath and a launder in my clothes. I'm sure you'll be extremely satisfied. Alright. Oh, and save the game too. I keep forgetting about that. So, yeah, I'm all clean. I'm gonna sell some stuff, fix some stuff. Mr. really isn't here. Wait. 
Oh, right. It also fills up my stats completely. Hmm. Oh, well. Okay, so we got that. Uh, I should probably... Which is closer? Probably the market, right? Yeah, the inn. After that, I'll go to the tailor. Might as well also ask him about different people who might need help around here. God be with you. Is that him? Not safe, can you? I hope I can be of help to you, Knight. Huh? A hard hand? Am I looking for a hard hand called Elijah? I'm looking for an odd jobber here. Elijah's his name. I don't remember what quest is this for. Yet? Yes, I know. I haven't seen him yet today, but he comes here almost daily. He's bound to show up. Ah. Well, thank you. Hmm. Okay. Are there any problems around here I might be able to help with? Well, depends what you're willing to do. Try asking at the monastery. Sometimes the monks need someone who can handle more secular affairs. And that's not all. There was one troublemaker around here not long ago. We dealt with him. He was selling some relics he claimed were miraculous. But it was nothing but worthless trinkets. The villagers sent the bloody swindler packing so fast you couldn't see his heels for dust. All the way to Ledechko, I believe. I reckon he won't last long there either. That's all I can think of. Ledechko, huh? Okay. That was helpful. Sort of. Hmm. I can talk to them. Maybe the... Right, the maids? Right. Will know something? Nope. That's odd. Be a bit more careful. Definitely not here. Unless it's him? Nope. Just a baker. Hey. So what exactly does the quest tell me? <clears throat> oh yeah, what was that? Huh, whatever. We'll be following Florian on his way to work and back, apart from which he often sits on the market square and watches Florian's house. Henry, I'm glad you came. Well, he did see Florian going earlier to his work, I think, so... If he's still on the way, I might be able to catch him. Back? I don't know. Is that him? I don't remember what he looks like anymore. No, just a random ass villager. doesn't make stupid shit like the drunken chaplain I, that was a but that was a great character palma i mean i get that it's not you know realistic and historically accurate obviously but it's a good character what what's his name procopius or something wow that guy's parents really didn't like them him Anyway, he was a great character, Palma. He's one of my favorite and most memorable characters from this game. Probably will be the most memorable character. After a while, when I'll forget, like, you know, most of the things about the game. And they give him background. Like, they explain why he's like that. He was the youngest son of a lord who didn't want to... Who went to learn, um, you know, to be part of the clergy because he was a... Oh, God damn it! Huh? 
Huh, somehow that... Hey, what's this? Blacksmith's son. Oh, right, that's the maintenance skill I just got, right? You got a weapon you've prepared yourself, you get a 10% attack bonus. Nice. Start brawling and having sex. It was really sudden, but that's why it was so funny, too, because it just came out of nowhere. And they, and they gave him, like, you know, a suitable background. I was fine with that. Where's that fucking... Oh, he's here. Master Jerome. That's Florian. Henry. I can't do anything with him right now. Okay, I guess for now... There's no one around here. What time is it? What time do people get off work here? I don't even know. Hmm. Who's this dude who's just chilling? Oh! Funny how we get to meet like this, huh, Rapata? Okay, stay right there, I'll be right back. Just gotta sell some shit and fix some shit. Yeah, but basically he's just, he's a guy who hates to be a priest. And he had his fun, he went like... Where is it? Oh, I'm right here. He went on, did his adventures, learned sword fighting, uh, saved a bunch of, I don't know, maids maybe? Uh, let me fix these for now, since I can. I'm really enjoying doing this after I figured out how to do it. Uh, so there's that, and he went around, and then eventually got tired of his life of adventure and decided to, you know, lean back on his on the profession that he learned and went to become a. Uh, a parish priest. Oh, well, you can't grind it in half, but you can definitely ruin it if you do it wrong. You can definitely fuck up your sword and uh, take its condition. Oh, nice, 100. Take its condition down to zero really easily if you wanted to. God be with you. I thought I was going to say pedophile, really. See when that smoke uh, goes up, watch the black smoke. I'll show you for a second. This isn't going to do it anyway. See if you do it too hard and, and the wrong angle. The black smoke comes out, and that's when you know you're fucking up. And you can just lower the... Um, let's see where it is now. Yeah, down to 20 from like 57 in a couple of seconds. Found your lost steam controller dongle and an old weed bag. <laughs> you legit can't buy any... Yeah, but I heard they were pretty shit, and that's why you can't buy any more from Steam. Because they just don't have anything to do with them anymore. Go. Ten out of ten, really? Oh, one level up in maintenance. Ninety-eight, that's good enough for me. Anything between ninety-five and a hundred is like you know, such a tiny difference. It's not worth actually looking for the specific pixel that you might have missed. But yeah, I really like this mechanic. I honestly wish it was a bigger thing, and that there were some things that you could, like the weapons, you couldn't fix weapons with kits that you have to use grindstones, because I'm really enjoying this. And it's a really great mechanic. Like, no game has done a... a maintenance mechanic like this. Mostly it's just like, you know, kits. Like, this game also has that. Or you go to someone to repair your shit. 
100. Good enough, yeah. Hey! Where's the blacksmith? I came to sell you shit, asshole. Is that him on a break or something? No. God damn it. I don't even know where he lives. I can't bother him there. Maybe that's him? I got no clue. I think it's the villager I saw earlier, though. Hey, who's there? No, just the villager. Fine, I'll, I'll sell the stuff later. I don't need to do it right this moment. Actually, I can run over there. Okay, well, to each his own wash. I just saw people. Aw, oh, goddammit, he went away! For real? He was. Oh no, he's there. Just a whiny idiot. Can I sell something to this guy? Nope. Okay, so hey, buddy. Let's see how he's. Uh, yeah, no plate armor. I can definitely use my sword. Let's have that at the ready. And yeah, I got everything I need pretty much. So, hey, Rapata. Are you Rapata by any chance? Pardon me? Do we know each other? No, but I'm hoping to change that. Uh, We're going to be real good friends. Well, I, I don't have much time right now. I'd best be off. It'll only take a moment. Um, all right then. What do you want? To get use the trackpads, but then it's super nice when you need it. Also, it's been a godsend for emulators and games that don't have a good... Really? Interesting. Well, if I had the money, I might have, like, you know, tried to buy a second-hand one, but I don't know. I got my 360 controller. I really enjoyed it. I just like how it fills your hand. You know, it's like the shape of your hand, and it's really comfortable. PS controllers, like, I, I grew up on the PS2, but it's just, it's too bony. Like, you know, it it's almost stabs you. Anyway. Uh, let's start with, with the small stuff and work it up. I know that you spy on Florian. I know you were involved in the kidnapping of the bathmaid. Oh. And I know why you're doing it all. Uh, it seems there's no point making excuses. None. Now tell me where their workshop is. Of course, of course. That that will be the best solution. So? Uh, let's leave it for another time. Are you kidding me? Is he going to try to attack me? Oh, stop, Rapita. No problem. Yeah, I can do that. Can I pickpocket him? Just just for shits and giggles. I want to check it out. Ah, uh, I was seen by a witness. Come what? How did... Asshole! Oh, you're mine. You're mine, Rapita. Where'd he go? Oh, you are shitting me. Oh, you have got to be fucking shitting me. Oh, there he is. I see him running. Okay, good jump. Let's get that fucking asshole. Yeah, that's the way I like it. And... There we go. I think that convinced you, right? That was nice. So, are you ready to talk? I will. I will. Just don't hurt me, please. What do you want from me? Tell me where the workshop is. Don't worry. Your master won't be punishing you for betraying him. You're both going to have too many other problems. Mm-hmm. It's in the Scullet's mines. Why am I not surprised? Down very much. On the eastern side of Scullet's Hill, there's an abandoned mine gallery. Well, it used to be abandoned. Now there's a small camp in front of it, and the workshop is inside. Who is your lord? So Yezhek, a Ronoff. Ronoff. That's what he calls himself, although Ronoff Castle's long gone. Ulrich's help. Oh yeah, I sent him off to that hill. For no other reason whatsoever. What happened to it? Ronoff used to belong to Vincent, Count Lichtenberg. After his death, it fell to Margrave Jobst. And he had it pulled down. He knew full well that Vincent's vassals would resist him. Why? Everyone knows that when a lord dies without issue, the king can confer his estate on whoever he pleases. 
But Vincent had the sentence. Ronoff only fell to the Margrave because he declared them all illegitimate. All because Vincent had refused to fight for him against Sir Prokop. Sir Yezhek led a revolt of the vassals. Politics, politics. The Jobs rounded them all up. Only Sir Yezhek got away. Since then, he's become the scourge of the domain. Interesting. Who are you, anyway? They call me Rapota. I used to be the executioner's henchman in Brno. And how did you come to be serving Sir Yezhek? I helped him escape from prison. If I was going to serve anyone, better Sir Yezhek than the executioner. So you saw being a brigand's henchman as a step up in the world? Yeah, exactly. I thought if things changed and he stopped marauding, he might get run off back and take me into his service. I see. Well, after this little escapade, you can forget about that. You'll be lucky if you don't end up swinging on the gallows. And it's all the same anyway now. I've betrayed him. Okay. I don't care. So who's the Yeshek working for? Don't tell me he just took it into his head one day to start forging coins. That's not for me to know. So Yezhek was on speaking terms with various lordships. Such as? Mm. We were often guests at the monastery, but I slept in the hayloft, so I heard nothing. And apart from that? In the camp, you'd occasionally see a Hungarian nobleman, mm -hmm. but I don't know what he was doing there, or who he is. Probably some connection that goes all the way up to uh, Sigismund. That's my guess. I think I've heard enough. Can I ask you something? Yes. I don't want to hang. It's a horrible death. I prefer you just kill me here and now. I'm not going to let him go away. He did like really major shit. If that's his wish, I'll give it to him. As you wish. Our father who art in heaven. What? Why am I being... Fine, I'll... Fine. I don't know what I did wrong, but whatever. Anyway, let's crunch his head. I think that's the quickest death I can give him. Why are guards after me? What are you waiting for? Finish it! You asked for it. What?! You little shit! Oh, you're gonna fucking die! There you go. See? Is that better? Idiot. Running away from me. Okay, let's see. What do I have here that's worth selling? No, no, no. Uh, okay. Yes. No. Yes. Oh, more solid shoes. Yellow hood, no, and maybe these. And I guess I'm wanted for something, whatever. I don't know what. Maybe because they killed him and didn't take, like, you know, let the law take care of him. But fuck it, I am the law. I work for uh, Sir Radzik of Sir Radzik Kabbala. Okay, so, uh, what did I want to do? Let's see. Secure all Rick's help, find the entrance. Uh, maybe I should report. Well, I'm gonna want to sell and repair anyway, so I might as well. I'll see if uh, Master Feyfar wants anything to do with it. Uh, let's also... Let's see, yeah, let's fix this and then we'll sell them all. to see with the sun right now. Oh, I can barely see. Is this enough? 97. Yeah, that's good enough for me. God save you! 
Uh, start with, with with these. Okay, what can I sell this guy? This. I wish there was a way to like uh, maintain arrows to kind of like the grindstone. That would have been awesome. Okay, so let's see. Uh, don't need this. Mm, don't need these seven copies. Don't need this. Don't need either of these. Oh, it's stolen though. He's not gonna want that. I'll take it back then. Uh, no. Oh, pfft. Uh, all of these. This is fine. Don't need this. Don't need this. Don't need this. Let's sell these five eyebrights. Oh, wait, that's like, wait, oh, fuck. Doesn't have enough money. I only just noticed. Use maximum pressure on the blade. I'm always using maximum pressure. It's it's more the angle. Um, sure, like I way I went way overboard with this. That's it. Fuck. Okay. Maybe after I pay him to repair some I'd of my like stuff. I'd like to discuss the pro. Agree. You're a yeah, yeah. Hey, Henry, it's time to see you. Finally. Okay, let me make sure I can't fix anything else. Oh, I even have some stuff on my horse. I totally forgot about that. I'll let him. I really don't need to like take. I don't know why I even took stuff to. Wait, no, I didn't want to buy and sell. My bad. Just the stuff I'm wearing, please. You can fix my hat, really? Oh, huh, okay. I'd like to discuss the price. I want to try well, something. Since I'm going to take his money anyway, can I like haggle up and argue to pay him more? Since I'm going to get that money anyway. I don't Here, need it. With a little something on top. <laughs> I can. My word. Thank you kindly. Or it probably really helps the reputation if I do that. I'm imagining. Let's see. Uh, 74. I don't know what it was earlier, but 74 is pretty good. Okay, so back to this. Um, it's barely anything for me to sell. Oh, I guess I can sell these. Ugh. You know, that's too much. Can we do something about the price? It's nice that they added like an extra. They didn't make it into a haggle, but like a, a nice little extra. Are we agreed? Uh, like you said, here's You're a, right, a little something off the top. Ah, oh, that would do it. Excellent. Okay, next up, I just need to visit the tailor, I think. And talk to Master Feyfar, and that's it. And maybe the tailor or the... maybe I'll be able to... Wait, who's that? That can't be the Riddler, can it? Oh no, it's just a priest. It's Caleb's priest, actually. These are guards, so I don't know. Oh, there we go. I was wondering when that will happen. Yeah, I'll just pay you, dude. I don't know what I did, but... Someone saw you steal. This definitely won't... Oh, because I pickpocketed that asshole?
Uh, okay. How much is it? Let's see if it's worth... Let's try this. Just my luck. Oh my god, it actually works. Look, I can't tell you anymore. The fate of the whole empire hangs in the balance between King Wenceslas and King Sigismund. High politics, you know? Not a peep to anyone. Well, I, I thought... That is... I had no idea. If that's how it is, of course you may go. <laughs> Idiot. Okay, at least it's not for the murder of Rapata. Even it's still kind of dumb. That someone saw, saw me pickpocketing the guy I later murdered. And that's what I'm being charged of. Wait, who's... Oh, that might be the trinket salesman or something. Hey, Sass oh, he's, he's a scribe. Bailiff. The Lord be praised. What brings you to me? Hmm. Okay. Nothing to report then, I suppose. What about the bailiff? God be with you. Might as well. Is there anything interesting? Going Wanted to on know here? if I can talk to him about Esther, there but is. I guess not. And when I get my hands on that bastard, his neck will be on the executioner's block. Okay. Is there anything, anything else you want to tell me? On here? There is. And when I get my hands. Okay, shut up. So that's that. How about the Master Armor? Who's not here? It's the next one. How are you, Henry? Uh, oh, there we go. This is a rich guy. Mm -hmm. Nah. I'll be, I'll be, no, actually, I'll check it out. Uh, orange shirt. Damn, too bad he doesn't want other stuff. He's got so much money. Mm, but fine, I think that's it. Can we do something about... Well... Besides, with 1.5, I might be able to get it up to... Nah. Yeah. That's a bit much, I don't think. I'll be up for that. 1930. What do you say to this? It's not worth it to me. And... Finally, nice. a reasonable sum. Okay. Oh, there's also more stuff on the horse I might be able to sell. Forgot about all this. Um, we'll keep this on him for now. No, keep this on me. No, that necklace does absolutely nothing for me. So fuck it. Let's settle along with the rest. Let's talk about the. Oh, yeah. Oh wait, it's like more than he can. Oh, screw it then. Didn't even notice. Um, fuck it. I'll find some other guy somewhere. Maybe another blacksmith. What's his name? Charlatan. Yeah, that's the guy. We'll do his quest at some point. Uh, where is the tailor? There he is. Goodbye, Henry. Henry, I'm glad you stopped by. How's it going? 
Mm, anything? I'll check about repairs for it in a second. Anything good I can sell you, maybe? Oh, yeah, these. And he's got plenty of money, great. And that's it. The rest is stolen. Excellent, then. I'd like to discuss the price. What? What do you say to this? That's still too much. Aye. For nice. That amount, I... Okay, great. One last thing is checking for repairs. I don't think there are any, but just to be sure. Nope, that's what I thought. Oh, okay, good. All right, so we're plenty ready to go back to our hometown where it all began. Oh, there he is. Okay, so first stop, getting uh, Ulrich's help. I'm sure he'll be happy. That oh, wow, that's... Much closer than I imagine. Okay, so I guess all of this is considered the Scalet's Mines. And Wabna too, maybe. So here. Oh, we actually saw... This is probably the place. We were there. And we were at the camp too, I think. Or was it another... I don't know. There were so many. We are definitely here, though. I remember this. Don't boo me, Mori. Oh, Anano. Sorry, you can boo me. It's okay. Chairs. Oh, it's a boo wave. Now I see. It's all good then. Okay, so we'll get Ulrich. With some luck, it won't be like an escort mission, but rather we'll get. Oh, there's a swordsmith here. Or a weaponsmith. Good to know. <clears throat> you know what? I'm. Just a tiny bit curious. I just want to see if he has. I doubt it, but if he has anything better than the weapons I have, since I'm loaded with so much money, might as well make some use of it. Oh boy, no one to stop the boo wave here, huh? It's Mori in his prime. Welcome, Henry. What? Okay, I guess the trader is fine too. Probably not, but yeah, nothing even close. Oh, hey, what's this? Oh, awesome, yeah, I want this. Yeah, I'll buy that shit from you. Let's have a word. Well. What about this? Honestly, all this haggling is just me being than... like really, really cheap. I got so much money, I can buy like this entire city basically if i wanted to finally fine i'll read it at some point when i have the time and off we go is that asshole's corpse yeah it's still floating there good if it stays there gets eaten by fish Should I? No. No sense. Oh! Good. What? Who's this guy? Is it another guy who wants to fight? Because I'm kind of over that right now. Wayfaring May Knight. I have your attention for a moment? I don't know. Should I fight We've him? We've met before, haven't we? Yeah, I think we, we have. have. And you defeated me in combat. Oh, so it's now, this type of thing. I'll seek a reprisal. Bubble we wager. Have you still got that armor that doesn't fit you? Ha! You haven't disappointed me. I quite understand. You won't fight just for the sake of it. But I mean, I could, but... Otherwise, what would be the point? Sure. All right. Why not? I'm glad to hear it. Let's get to it, then. Yeah, let's. This time I got my fucking mace here. 
Okay. No, oh, that's already a good one. Another one. I'll make quick work of him, I think. Especially if he doesn't have a shield. I think I also got an ability that lowers morale when I manage to dodge. Curse it. Not doing much damage. I wonder if maybe I should change. Blood will be spilled. Shit, asshole. Dude, I got an actual fight I'm going to, okay? What is that weird ass laugh? There we go. Come on, how much more? Now look at us trading blows like this. What? Asshole. Ah, oh, shit! Maybe I should stop dodging. I think this is about a lower morale I can get out of him. Finally. Oh, almost killed you there. Here. The reward you've earned. Oh, another one of these? Yeah, that I got a bunch a of those. Jewel, Might be useful though, because if mine is uh Yeah, I can just switch. Nice. Because mine just has two points off. Uh okay, let me see about the rest. Is there anything? Oh, I might as well just do a quick check. Uh eat something to heal myself, I suppose. How much health do I have? Oh, 98. I'll be fine, I guess. I trust my I trust myself that much. Uh, let's just make sure we're fixing everything. I wonder if they also have a cobbler here. Should have checked. Since my kid isn't going to hold out for much longer. the XP. Ah, damn it. Whoa, well, right. Have another one. Excellent. So we're all good. We're practically back to 100%. Well, let's get the other knight who we shamefully beat before. I wonder how many more times that knight will show up. I wonder what's the real reason for sending him up there, since obviously we're not using that and we just killed like Rapota, the guy who was supposed to do that. Maybe if we lose Rapota, or maybe if we don't like get all the information, I don't know. We pretty much just send him on a wild goose chase. It almost to get killed. Like if we weren't here to help him, he would have died. Oh, we got everything I need here, right? Something here that really heals well. at all. All right then. I like his accent too. It's kind of a cool accent. I finally found out where the forger's workshop is. Master Feyfar was right. The forgers are sticking close to the supply source. Their workshop is somewhere in the mines. The entrance is on the eastern side of the hill. I've no idea what to expect there. 
but I'd rather go there with some backup. I will be glad to give it. Lead on. Sweet. And we get a fast travel again? Oh, no. Or do we? I think we're here. Oh yeah, the game even saved for me. Perfect. Okay, so yeah, that was nice. Yeah, that's probably the smart thing to do. Uh, I should have my... I think... Let's start with the mace first. Oh, he's just charging right in. Wait, maybe I'll, I'll have a chance to talk to them first or something. I doubt it, but... Where is it? Oh. Oh, now we gotta find. Fuck. Well, this is kind of ridiculous. Find the counterfeiter's works. It can be literally anywhere, though. Where's Ulrich? I'm following your lead, my dude. Oh, I think we found it. Shit, what's that strength? Excellent. Let's get that perk point. Because this is going to be a hell of a fight, I think. Strength, strength. What do I have left? Gravedigger, heavy swing. Attack costs 20% more damage, but costs 10% more stamina. Ugh, I don't want to do that. Bumping into him at a sprint. Fuck it, yeah, let's... Oh, but my armor needs to be heavy. Squid, none of these are really good right now. I'll just deal with it. Oh, we level up with a mace, too. God, I hate guys with shields. I'm going to enjoy this. You dear. Fuck! Yeah, Ulrich, how about some fucking help while I'm getting all the We're aggro here? There we go. Let me get that crunch. Best sound effect in the entire game, honestly. Okay, so it looks like we found, like, I don't know, one spot at the very least? Or I don't know, something. Let me grab their money. I don't really need to sell anything anymore. Oh, wait. Dude, hold on. Where'd he go? Shit, I think I lost Ulrich. Oh, no, there he is. What are you doing here? Hi. Tired of lying, are you? What? Why did they sneak up on him from behind? <clears throat> Shit, there's barely, barely any room to find in here. Hey, dude, I want the crunch. There we go. Sounds even better with an echo. Yeah, there was a, someone else I killed here. Wow, he's just like not wasting time at all, is he? I can hear sounds of fighting, but... Oh! Wow, Ulfric, you're really good at this. So, cutscene? Yep. Nice. Hey, boys. Oh, that's probably the Sir Yehek or whatever. Jesus Christ. Who are you and what are you doing here? I'm here at the command of the Royal Hetman, the Raja Kabila. Oh, no, don't let Ulfric betray me. And who's he? Okay, no. Because he was behind me, so That's I was worried. No concern of yours. I'm sure we could come to some sort of agreement. Uh, I have plenty of coin. <laughs> we can come to an agreement that you'll keep your mouth shut. Oh. Nice. <sighs> oh. Please, don't take this personally. Wait! What? Do you want to do it? Be my guest. It gives me no pleasure. You can't kill him. I have orders to take him to Ratai. 
That is unfortunate. I have orders to kill everyone involved in this business. Oh no, you come can't on. Do that. Don't pit me against him. I have no choice, as you are aware. No. Let me convince him. I know I can. Time to waste. Arrest him? Why do you want to kill him? Oh, okay, there we go. He may have valuable information. For that exact reason, my master does not wish this man to fall mm. into the wrong hands. Especially those of Razi for Bill. Well, then we have a problem here. He won't, but I'll try. You can tell your lord the man is dead. He'll never find out. But he will. Or do you think you can lock this man away from sight until judgment day? Why not? He's you gonna die anyway, boy. just not immediately. Look around you. This land swarms with rats and snakes, especially now. There is no secret that is not. For no, he's right, but if I, let I you saved your life, dude. You owe me one. My will be on a spike before the month is out. I'll try. I don't know. You don't have to go back to the Rosenbergs. I'm definitely not tougher than him, so. How do you know about the Rosenbergs? Master Fayfire recognized the writing on your letter of passage. Just as I said, there is nothing safe from prying eyes in this land. And where would you suggest? Come with me, go? dude. Into Sir Radzik's service. He needs people like you. Yeah, dude, I you can be my friend. Out of the question. If he learned of all that I did for the Rosenbergs, he would hang me from the nearest tree. But you are right. Oh. I do not have to return to the Rosenbergs. In fact, I cannot. Why not? I am a knight without a crest, without allegiance. No one was meant to know whom I serve. If the Rosenbergs hear that mm. I have been found out, so they will see fucked him. I vanish. They cannot afford to be associated with me. Where will you go then? Where the road takes me. As I have many times before. Oh, I really hope he shows up Farrow in the sequel. Auf Wiedersehen. Ulrich, you're a great guy. I'm really happy I didn't have to kill you. So this guy's gone. Bye, Ulrich. That's it. The wrist just cleared out. Let's look and talk to him. Okay, let's see what we got here. Probably nothing, but... I can go up there. I really want to kind of save just to fucking kill him. And see what happens. I think I'm going to do that. Yeah, there's nothing of interest around here. Just to kill him and see what... Uh, what's his face will say? What Ul Ulrich will say? Oh, I can't! Oh, it's because I got no Savior Schnapps. I can fix that. Just give me like... I should probably make a bit more soon. Let's grab like three. Here's one of them right now. I'll be a bit drunk, but I'll be fine. So, oh, it's what I should have, should have known. He's one of those enemies you can't, can't actually do anything to. Believe me, I tried this many times before on other, on other important NPCs. There's just nothing you can do to them. I wonder, since I saved, I wonder if I can, all, if I can betray him too, Ulrich, or is it going to be... I can't believe! Ew. What happens if I talk to him? Oh, he's just like a regular dude. Stop whining and fight! Hey, you beast! Funny that they actually gave him these uh, lines. Oh, he's got his own sword? Wait, let's see what he's carrying, actually. I'm kind of curious before we turn back the... Turn back time. Knight's Waffen Rock. Mm, not very good. Nuremberghian Circus. Oh. Yeah, he's got some nice shit on him. A trunk key. Interesting. Long Noble Hobrek. He's got some really nice stuff. Maybe even better than mine. What was that? Wasn't his sword, though? Oh, his sword isn't here. He has one ordinary arrow and no bow. Robber Baron sword? Really? That's like his thing? 
How good is it? I'm just kind of curious now. It's pretty shitty. Well, it's not shitty, but it's like way really not as good. And it's a short sword, which I hate to use. So yeah. Back to the good timeline. Oh yeah, that's true, Wash. Especially when killing. I hear it helps a lot. So yeah, let's do this legit now. Please, please. I'm sure we can come to some sort of agreement. You can talk all you like. Oh. But not here, and not to me. A bit off to the side there, uh, cameraman. Let's go. Master Feyfar is very keen to meet you. Are you going to have some sort of surprise, or...? No, that went pretty smoothly. Gingerbate. Oh, here, they got him. Good work, Henry. Thank you, Master Feyfar. I think it was tremendous work. It wasn't easy, I can tell you. I'll take some men and have a good look around there. And what should I do? You should get some rest and go to Rate. In the meantime, Sir Radzig will have this wretch questioned. Maybe he'll get something useful out of him. All right. I'll see you in Rate then. Man, I'm the best. Okay, do I have to physically return to Rate or are they going to help me out with that? Seems like they're going to help me out. Could have taken a nice visit to the bath, though, first. Probably could have used it. Poor Ulrich. I really, really hope he comes. Oh, they. Where am I? Oh yeah, I'm still in. I'm still over here. Oh, because I gotta physically go to Rate and speak to Radzig and tell him everything. All right. Uh, anything I might want to do before that, since we're already around here. I didn't get any equipment. Oh, I got this. I can sell. Stolen stuff is still marked as, as stolen. I have this patched hose for some reason. Mm. Let me try and fix everything I have, then we'll see what exactly we need to do before our travels. I think I actually fixed everything. Oh no, there was another fight after that. Really liking this mace. I'm really regretting not using it earlier. Well, maybe it's more of a late game weapon though. That should do it, especially if I'm going to Rate. Shouldn't have any problems at all. And I definitely shouldn't be holding a fucking torch. Oh, nice. The shield is also bloody now. That's pretty cool. All right, then. So... Let me just quickly fix everything I need fixed, and we'll be on our way. My respects to you. Nothing. Excellent. Just what I like. I'll have a quick visit to the. Oh, hey Pebbles. I'll have a quick visit to the blacksmith, and we're out of here. Back to our hometown. Maybe I should take how much? Oh no, it's already almost uh, night time. No, I'm not dealing with this anymore. Last time I tried to help someone, it ended really badly. So I think if we're quick, it's not that far away. I think we might have a chance of getting there before nighttime. Spank some chickens if if I see any, Mori. Anything I need to fix here? Yes, this, 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 and this. Odd that a blacksmith can fix the nobleman's hat, but not the tailor for some odd reason. Whatever. I might as well just keep the selling to Rate since over there I think the items mm, won't be marked right, marked as stolen. 
Are we agreed? No. But I think we're actually nearing, like, really getting close to the oh, end of the so main story. Which is what I was hoping to accomplish today, actually. All right, here we are. Let's see what's the quickest way down to Rate. It's a ways, but not like a terrible ways. Okay, so up, then through the yeah, northwest, this, yeah, northeast, through the bridge, east and south, and then southeast. All right. Thank you, Sasso. You've been great. We'll see. I wonder if they did this, if they like didn't transport us all the way to Rate because, hold on, which, obviously the right one. I wonder if they did this because we might have some kind of ambush on a way or like a special event. Or just because we're trying to like prolong the game just a bit more. Also, it would have been nice to have a bit of horse right about now, but too bad. Now here's a crossing point. Now it's just pure east, if I remember right. Probably just sticking to this path. Oh, saw a bunny there. Should I also spank bunnies, Mori? I don't know if I can, honestly, but should I even try? Oh, south. South and then east. Oh yeah, this is going way quicker than I thought. We're definitely going to get there before nightfall. God, I'm so happy. I upped my speech so I couldn't so I was able to convince him. I feel really shitty if I had to kill him. Shut Oh, maybe you should, Mori. That's a great idea you had there. Okay, and yeah, from here I pretty much know it by heart. We've been done this road so many times. I'm testing you, Mori. I'm testing you hard. <clears throat> Show me if you got what it takes to actually spank me. Me, anomaly the unspankable. That's what they call me here. There we go, yeah, I can even see Rate. Now I just need to get to the crossing point, which I have a fairly good idea where it is, even without looking at the map, I think. end of this road, if I remember right. Should be a couple of cottages. Yep. Perfect. Okay, so we're even going to have enough time to to talk to Sir Radzig at night. I was afraid it's going to be all dark and shit. Also, I wonder if that just like, you know, out of curiosity, I wonder if those Rosenbergs are like a Jewish family, because Rosenberg is a really Jewish name. But I find it highly, highly unlikely that there would be any nobles in this time in Eastern Europe who are Jewish. It seems like really out of the norm to me. But I don't know, like, I suppose they could have the name and not be Jewish. I'm not sure what the exact translation of Rosenberg is, but might be. Okay, here we are. Home sweet home. 
Oh man, I better. I'm probably gonna get like a huge house after this. Last time I got this small. Well, it's a great room. But next time it's gonna be fucking amazing. Good day, Henry. Okay, so Ratzig, let's see, because I, I think he's in that tower? Not close enough. Let's just walk around a bit. Rosenberg is Village of Roses? Oh, so yeah, well, there's nothing specifically Jewish about that. I suppose it could have Move it. Oh, there he is. Okay, let's go to a, like, it's down over here where it's a good place to talk. Oh, what? Radzik, I think he's stuck. I think his AI is kind of stuck on this path. Or not. Hey! Move it. Yo, Radzi. There's the man. Good work, Henry. Thank That's you, right, sir. I am the man. I tell you to take a well earned rest, but unfortunately, mm. I need one more thing from you. Whatever you command. Yezhek refuses to talk to us. The stubborn bastard's asking to see you. Me? Nice, I love interrogation Indeed. missions. Normally I'd send for Captain Burner to beat it out of him, but then I told myself that if he's so keen to speak to you... I'll try to get something out of him. Where is he? He's locked up in the tower. Bernard will... Oh, that's why he was there. Very well, sir. Well, I gotta go see Bernie. Come on. Where is he now? Probably all the way on the other side of the... Yeah, the training grounds. Get the keys to Yezhek's cell. I can probably... Oh, it's over there. Oh, I thought he was in the tower. Never mind. Well, not a great... I can probably unlock it, but... Let's make this legit. Also, kind of like... Bernie didn't really like me at first. I kind of want to rub it in his face now. I'm the head honcho. So you bought this sour patch, something. It helps someone. Please take them away from you. Why? Are you addicted? Just finish it off, dude. It doesn't look like a big bag. Or is it one of those like you know, uh, 50 pound bags that you can get off of Amazon for no good reason? Some chamomile. I'm honored that you should come to me. Oh, that's a nice change in your attitude. Oh, it's two pounds. Oh shit, dude. Wow, yeah, that's a bit excessive. Um, yeah, and if it was. If I were instead of you, I'd probably eat them all in a night or something. I'd get the worst fucking stomach ache. Uh, I don't know, dude. Don't you have, like, I don't know, any siblings or roommates or anything? Am I one in on this? Or just, oh, you know what? Get Bring them to work. Bring them with you to work. Just lay them down and say, here, if anybody wants, feel free. That's what I would do. And that way you also score some brownie points. I need the key to Yezhek's cell. Hmm. So, so Radzik let him have his way in the end. Let me beat some answers out of him. Yeah, but I'm better. I won't be an asshole, though. Don't take it that way. He probably wants to talk to me because he reckons he can hoodwink me. But that's where he's wrong. Just try not to mess it up. Here's that key. I was nice Bye. to you, douche. Fine. Got the cell key. Let's go do this. Got a bit of time for sundown. Wondering if I should save first. I mean, why not? Especially with all the money I got, I got plenty of. Uh, I can buy plenty of save potions if I really wanted to. And this is supposedly nearing the end of the main quest, so. Okay, rat house. Why do we get in there exactly? I always seem to forget. I think it's through here. 
And down here or something? Yeah. Is the other guy? Oh, he's probably dead already, yeah. But another guy in here. He's gone. Probably not a good ending for him. Oh, I actually couldn't have unlocked it. It's one of those. Okay. Um, yeah, screw it. Let's save. Why do I care? Just be a bit drunk when I talk to him. Hurry it up. We haven't got time to waste. Excuse me, sir? It's just you and me here now, boy. Okay, hold on. Just gonna make sure again I'm at my absolute most charismatic. Let's see. Oh, shit. I hate when... I hate when I do it like that. So this and where's the ring? Bianca's ring? Okay. Rest of it. I know that this ups my curse. Oh, like three whole fucking points. Damn. What? Ah, uh, fucking. Um, these don't help since I have this. Nope, doesn't help either. <laughs> well, that's going to lower my charisma. It's not going to do a thing. Neither is this. Nope. Okay. That's my most charismatic, which is pretty great, actually. 16 is really high. So. Well, finally, I've had quite a wait. Why do you want to talk to me, of all people? You brought me here. You should consider it an honor. You should consider it an honor I have... I've let you live, asshole. If hanging around in a damp dungeon with a condemned man is your idea of honor... You're not seeing the bright side. You can be the one who uncovers a conspiracy against the king for your master. You don't get an opportunity like that every day. It did cross my mind, though, that it might be nice to get some assurances for my cooperation. After all, I'm the one the Margrave unjustly declared the scourge of the land and expelled from Moravia. They even pulled my beautiful castle down. It was the necessity of making a living that forced me to take some liberties. Mm. Do you really want to question the authority of the Margrave? I've always been loyal to the crown, but what can I do when the Margrave stole my fief? None of my no problems, Margrave. dude. I don't care about your conflict with the Margrave. It's your crimes against the king I'm worried about. The king you say you've always been so loyal to. Very well, ask me anything you want. I won't be obstructive. What I want to know most of all is who's behind it. Who were you making those forgeries for? Do you think I couldn't have handled it all myself? I'm not trying to insult you. It's just not a job one man could do alone. All right, the I way it, it was began you. was I was short of coin, as usual. So I let those crimps in Sassau recruit me. Recruit you into what? I didn't inquire too much. In this business, you don't ask too many questions. But when they found out I wasn't just anybody, they put me in charge of the counterfeiting. A foreigner by the name of Eric gave me instructions. But for sure, he isn't the chief. Eric. And there's someone highly placed at the monastery who's mixed up in it, too. But I don't know who. Okay. Yeah, let's go over everything. How did you come to hear of all this business? I met some old friends in Colleen a few months ago, and they said they were heading for Sassau, that armed men were being recruited, and they'll hire anyone. Old friends? Who were they? Just a couple of brigands. We used to ambush the Margrave's messengers in Moravia together. Nice friends uh -huh. you keep. I was in dispute with the Margrave. A man in my position finds himself mixed up with all sorts. And then what? Rapota and I had been living off stale crusts for a month, so I wasn't going All to right, turn Rapota. down the chance of Forgot work, about him already. honest or otherwise. We rode to Sassau and met with the recruiters. It didn't take long to realize I was a nobleman fallen on hard times. 
not some common peasant. Can you get to the point? Well, they introduced me to this Eric, and he told me what was needed. They set up the workshop, got the men, the supplies, everything. Crimps, you're telling me this Eric is recruiting armed men in Sassau? Well, it seems so. I was giving the recruiters some of the coins to do it. The fake ones, of course. Where can I find the recruiting gang? That's tricky. It was my friends who led me to them. We met with them in the woods next to Sassau. It's about who you know, as always. You said you gave them money. Where was that? They'd ride to the mine gallery to see me. I don't suppose you'd find them there now. Hmm. If you say so. Mm -hmm. This Eric, you reckon he's not the one in charge? He puts on airs, but he's just a naive young pup. And he's always going on about his lord, though he never mentioned him by name. Where can I find this Eric? You must have had some meeting place. He used to come to the workshop unannounced. And after what's happened, I doubt he'll be showing his face there again. So far you're not being that helpful, dude. This highly placed person at the monastery, what can you tell me about him? I have no idea who he also, is. Also, he didn't make me no small promise him anything yet, all, so he, he can still hang. the exchange of the forgeries in Passau. Hmm, I see. Is there anything else at all you can tell me about him? No, he was supposed to supply me with materials too, but he backed out. Eric said he probably got cold feet. Mm hmm Okay, I guess that's all I got. That'll do me for the moment. Will you put in a word for me with Sir Radzig? I'll swear allegiance to him if he'll have me. I'm sick of being a renegade. I'll have to think about it. I don't want to annoy Sir Radzig. We'll see if the opportunity presents itself, you know? Okay, I really... There was really no reason at all for me to save. I wonder what happens if I just leave it... open. He probably won't run away, but still, kind of funny. Okay, so what are we doing now? Reporting back? Yep, a lot of useful things. Um, told me about Eric, but he didn't give me any way to reach him, so. Only if we could get like, I don't know, an underground operation going on, like an undercover, I meant operation. Uh, try and get recruited, even though I think everybody knows my face and name already around there. Welcome. I hate when this happens. Ugh. Come on, there we go. Okay, where is he now? Fucking tower of his. Or is he just around here? No, he's definitely said. Oh, where does this lead? Oh, just along the walls. Welcome, Henry. Thank you. I move it. Oh, here I am, my lord. Yeah, you're a bit confused, my lord. So what have you learned? All sorts of things. There's some foreigner called Eric behind the counterfeiting ring. And someone highly placed at the monastery. The monastery? Really? That's what Yezhek claimed. So it's worse than I thought. If this is true, we'll have to proceed with the utmost caution. Why? Can't we just go to the monastery to investigate? No. If the church is truly involved, I have no authority. Hmm. So what will you do? I'll have to think about it. It won't be an easy nut to crack. I'll have to consult with Hanush. And what of this Eric? Who is Whoa. he? I don't know, but he's recruiting armed men in Sassau and forming an army. Damn! So it looks like Pribislavitz wasn't the end of it. It most certainly wasn't, sir. And what's more, Sir Yezhek is convinced this Eric is only a go-between, and there's someone bigger behind him. You should return to Sasso and take a closer look at those recruiters. 
If they're going to attack, we must find out sooner than last time. It might not be as straightforward as that. So Yezak didn't know them and has no idea how to find them. You'll have to manage somehow, my lad. Don't tell me there's an armed force amassing here and nobody knows anything. Go to Sasso and try to find them. I'm, uh, I'm not sure where to start, sir. Then ask around the alehouses and inns, or at the Rad House. Someone must have heard something. These things can't be entirely kept in the dark. Whatever you do, be careful, Henry. And best not mention my name. It would attract unwelcome attention. What we want is for the crimps to take you for just another village lad they can lure into their gang. All right, sir. I'll try to blend in as best I can. I know I'm asking a lot of you, but I know of no one else who could help as much as you can now. I didn't promise him, but let's give it a try. We'll see how mad he is. Sir, there's one more thing. Sir Yezhek went with me without resistance because I promised him he could come to an agreement with you. My boy, my boy. You make promises in my name. Okay, definitely going to reload on that. It turn out very badly for both of us. But if it can prevent bloodshed, why the hell not? We may well come to some arrangement after all. Oh, okay. So it was good. I can't say yet what will become of him. You'd better run along. As you command, sir. <laughs> Over the top. Okay, so there is another quest. For some reason, I was told that that was the last quest, the one we just finished. So let me think now. Uh, after the affair with the counterfeiters, it's become clear that Sasso conceals many secrets. There's talk that there are crimps, as they're called, recruiting men for a new bandit camp. So I need to talk to the bailiff, the innkeeper, uh, and ask the innkeeper at the Wagoner's Inn about the crimps. Oh, hey, Herianos. Great to see you again. I'm actually thinking that right now I might be finishing this up. Because surprisingly, I thought I was finishing the last quest in the game, but apparently I wasn't since there's another one. Uh, but it's still pretty sweet, it's still cool. Mori, be nice to Herionos. He's our friend, don't you know? How are these still marked stolen? <laughs> yeah, no, I'm sorry, dude. I, I was, usually I would have kept going, but I've just, I don't know. I have a lot of work to do and all that, so I don't know. Okay, so what we're going to do is, I think, like this. What's that? Another quest giver. So, what I'm thinking is this. Since tomorrow, a new game that I wanted to stream is being released called Chuchil. I think I'm going to do that, and unfortunately, I won't be able to keep going on with Kingdom Come Deliverance. As much as I absolutely love this game, I'm enjoying it so much. I think it's really addictive and I'm really having a lot, a lot, a lot of fun with it. Uh, but, gotta think big. Uh, so I'm gonna move on to Chuchol. I think it's, uh, well, here, you know, stick around. Maybe someone else will stream soon. It happens. Uh, some guy might pop up in like five minutes and stream. So, yeah, so I'm gonna put uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance on like, um, not on the shelf exactly, but like it's gonna take uh, one step backwards and I'm gonna do Chuchil. Chuchil seems like a relatively short game. I don't think that more than 10 hours, but it does depend on puzzles, so it could still take me a long time. Chuchil. Uh, yeah, wash. It's released tomorrow. It's by the same guys who did uh, Machin Machinarium, if that's how you say it, and Samorost, and all these cool little puzzle games. Uh, as soon as I'm done on the stream, I'll send you a link to the Steam page. Watch. Uh, so that's it. So we're going to do that. If I finish the game on time, we're going to keep doing the main quest here and even the, the side quests. Because I really, really like it. I, as I said, I adore this game. I'm going to do like a quick recap. Fontanicula? I think they did like some a similar game like that as well. It might be also theirs. But Botanic? I don't know. I remember there was some, some game they had with something with Botanic too. 
Maybe I'm just confused with the uh, machinarium. I'm not sure. Anyway, this game, I just want to say, since I'm uh, kind of taking a step backwards from it, unfortunately, it's really amazing. If you enjoy open world Western RPGs, especially in medieval times, you got to try this out. If you want to wait a couple of weeks, uh, do it. They're probably going to uh, patch out most of the bugs. Some mods are going to go in. Maybe they're going to announce some DLC. I would happily play pay DLC for this because it's obvious that these guys uh, are in it for heart and not for the money. Um, so yeah, this is just a great, great game. Highly recommend it. A lot of fun. A lot of thought and heart has been put into this and it's obvious all the time. And I'm most of all curious about like what they're going to do next. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing for a first game. I think if you compare it to like, you know, Bethesda, CD Projekt Red, their first games weren't like this. They were much, much less ambi ambitious and probably much, uh, like probably not as well made. This meme duck roll, it's kind of like a, it's it's uh, the Rick roll before there was a Rick roll. That's it. Before there was a Rick roll, you just like post a link and, and it would be a duck roll. And people would say, hi, you got duck rolled. That's it. So I think that's enough of uh, my uh, my uh, love poems to this great game. And so that's it. So I'll be off, guys. I'll be back tomorrow. Not with Mountain Campaign as usual, since one of the guys can't make it. But we're going to do something else. A one-time uh, game that's called Everyone is John. It sounds like it's going to be a fucking blast. Since it's basically uh, the GM who's going to be Drops, Super Drops. Uh, he's going to be John, a man from Milwaukee who hears voices. And me and three other guys are going to be the voices. While we're trying to do make him do all kinds of... Uh, crazy goals and uh, obsessions and shit like that. So yeah, a fun, funny game. Uh, lots of improvisations. Mental health is involved, which is always fun. And I think that's it. So I hope you guys join me. Uh, it's on the schedule. One hour earlier than today. Not same as time as today. And, and I'll be back later uh, during the week for, with uh, some chucho. We'll see how that works out. And if we're lucky before the game after that, we'll have, we might have some time to get back to this game, hopefully. Or for some maybe casual streams if I ever get the time again. So that's it. I've been blabbering on enough. Thank you for uh, taking that. Uh, remember, if you feel like it, you can follow me on Twitch. Oh, Herianos, especially for you. If you want, obviously not mandatory, uh, feel free to follow me on Twitch, Twitter, or Steam. That way you get notifications whenever I'm starting to stream. And you can't, and you won't miss it. And uh, you can also feel free to follow me on Twitch and YouTube to watch past broadcasts of this and other games as well. So that's it, I think. Uh, Henry's going to go to bed now. Oh, not there. Henry's going to go to bed now, and that's pretty much it. So good night, Henry. Goodbye, everybody. No SSH plug? Um... Yeah, if you guys, sure, like, I don't think there's anyone around, but remember to stick around on Safety Heroes. Someone might pop up and do a stream later on tonight, hopefully. I'll be around, so uh, come on by. And that's it for now, guys. Uh, take care, everybody. Have a great week. I'll see you guys tomorrow, and uh, that's it. Marco.